Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Sagittarius. It's Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the week of December 7th through December 13th, okay? So, we are just going to see what comes up for you, Sagittarius. What do we have for Sagittarius and overall energy, please? What do we have for Sagittarius? One card, please. The healing light. That is beautiful. It's beautiful. Spirit. So it's a spiritual energy. The spirit is going to be helping you to heal by the looks of things. Let's see if I can find the spirit uh, section. I'd like to read this to you. <clears throat> I should focus. A beautiful spirit holds a brilliant sphere of healing light. A gentle yet powerful radiance reaches onward from the orb into your own heart. A time of great personal blessings is in store for you. Loving spirits are ready to bring their healing energy to you at this time. If you have a physical condition that you seek to remedy, meditate, meditate, on that part of the body involved and allow spirit to bring divine light there. You can use all the tools at your disposal, traditional and metaphysical, to generate the healing that you long for. So be conscious and intuitive in all of your self-healing. It is if it is mental or emotional issue you're dealing with, call for your angels to fill your mind and heart with their healing love. Even relationships can benefit from the incredible power of divine love. Meditate on the light within and around you. Ask for guidance and healing and let yourself be willing to receive. This card brings a message of potential miracles in your life. Connect with the loving healers in the spirit and angelic world. And don't forget the unlimited blessings that come from the ever-present energy of the divine. It's pretty amazing considering it is Sagittarius season, okay, as we are doing this reading. They are, this is your time, okay? It's your time. It's time. It's time for you to be healed, okay? Call in that healing light. Call it in to heal your mind, to heal your heart, uh, to purify, to remove all the stress and the depression and the anxiety, Call in protection, okay? You are being protected. So this is a this is a healing light. This is a miraculous change, okay? So it looks really good. So what about love? What about love for Sagittarius? You're going through a miraculous change, and it may mean healing from something that uh, abused you. You know, there it is. Interesting, came out where it reversed. You deserve love. You deserve love. You are lovable. And I feel like you've been in a situation where somebody that did not reciprocate or may have made you feel like that looks like the archer, huh? You deserve love. And I feel like you don't, you, you haven't been loved. It feels like you you've been lacking in that arena. I feel like there is some sort of divine protection here. The divine is saying that you deserve love and it, it, it comes from within. Okay. Get prepared to shine. Your vibration is going to be raising. You're going to be feeling all types of energy. It's kind of like Reiki or Reiki, however you say it. You know, energy is going to be flowing in your direction from the divine. Okay, this is a very healing energy. You deserve to be loved. So for this next week, you are probably going to be feeling a lot of positive energy, a lot of healing, a lot of releasing. It could be even be emotional, 
okay um, yeah so this looks really 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 good Sagittarius um, whoops sorry I kicked that might be a little bit of bumps in the road a miraculous change of healing is coming your way four of pentacles stability hold on to your money um, you don't need to spend your money hold on to your money during this time uh, save, 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 okay? Um, the hangman reversed. Six of swords reversed. Oh, this is on the path to recovery. Stability. So, stability. On the path to recovery, forgiveness is needed. It's time to leave the past hurts behind. Going through a period, of, you've been through a period of enlightenment, I feel. I feel like you've already been punished, right? You've already had to learn some difficult lesson. You've faced some major struggles. You've, you've been in a troublesome situation. I feel like um, there's definitely a need for change. I feel like there's been a lot of punishment here. I do, I do. And I feel like you've been stuck. You've, you've been stuck. There's some stubbornness as well. So I feel like there maybe at some point you've been refusing to change. Or you're dealing with somebody that refuses to change. Somebody that refuses to take a new approach. I feel you could you could have been abused by somebody who um, is egotistical. This person is very egotistical. They like to fight a lot. They're very troubled. Um, they're keeping you stuck. I feel somebody has been keeping you stuck and making you feel like everything is your fault. I feel like the divine is guiding you out of this situation. Okay? They are. They are. Maybe that's why I'm saying save your money or, you know, maybe it's time to leave this all behind. Take your money and leave. Maybe that's what it is. Um, three of Swords reverse. That is on the path to recovery. You are definitely on the path to recovery. Um, ooh, the tower. End of a commitment, an unhappy home. You've been in a situation, maybe you've been living with somebody who is very problematic. This person likes to fight a lot. You've been, it feels like you've been living with somebody that is dark. Um, maybe this person has some mental health issues or something. Could be a Pisces, could be a Libra, Gemini, or an Aquarius. This person has made you feel like you're not lovable. Anyhow, I feel like this party is over. I feel like this is a messy situation. I think that everything has crumbled or it's crumbling or it's going to crumble very, very fast. You may have been able to avoid disruption, but you can't avoid it forever. You can't avoid it forever. And I feel like time's up. I feel like time's up. I feel like there's going to be a major event that uh, forces you. And, and it's been avoided. It's been avoided for some time. But this is a forced change. And the universe or the angels or spirit is forcing a change. They are for forcing you out of an unhappy situation that you have been reluctant to move on from. It's like you've been tied to this situation, refusing to struggle through this, you know, refusing to let go of something. And I feel like you, because, you know, maybe because of money, maybe you didn't have the money or be, it felt stable or you didn't want to deal with, with chaos. You didn't want to deal with change. You didn't want to deal with disruption, but there is some sort of force here. Okay. There's force. It's time to leave this behind. It's time to rebuild. Maybe it's time for you to build your own foundation. Maybe it's time for you to have your own home or your own, uh, establishment or something like that. Um, four of wands reverse now that i'm under if there's the, this is this could be the end of a commitment okay getting out of a false uh foundation you know you've been there for a long time it feels like you've been staying there for a long time and it's definitely time to go it's it's time for you to rebuild right it is it's time for you to build up something stronger build something your own um Moving very, very quickly, taking taking 
action, okay? I feel like you're throwing yourself into a change. This is like being very direct. You, you could be suddenly leaving as well, or somebody could be. Somebody could also be coming in very, very fast with that, that Knight of Swords. Um, but that is being assertive. It's, it's uh, making a move. Make, it could also be making a getaway. Um, getting out really, really, really quick. You know, you may have to get out of a situation really, really quick. I don't know if there's going to be, you know, there could be a storm, there could be an event, there could be a crash. I'm just being honest with you, okay? Where you have to get out very, very quick, you know? But it's time, okay? Because wherever you've been, there's been, there's been pain, okay? There's been suffering. It's been, it's been less than harmonious. It's been less than peaceful. It's probably been over for a long time. It probably has. I feel like you've also been under somebody else's control, you know, and and I feel like it's time for you to make a move. All right, um, maybe it's time for you to relax. It's time for you to breathe. It's time for you to to be at peace. And where you've been, there's been no peace. It's been a constant struggle by the looks of things. Okay. Um, anyhow, I feel like there could be some sort of anger that is, there could be an angry outburst, okay, there could be a fight, I, I'm just being honest with you, okay, that causes somebody to leave suddenly, okay, um, now there's, there's leaving, there's being, taking, taking action, um, there it is. Seven of Wands. I do feel like there's going to be a fight. Okay? We do have a battle here. Stiff com competition or opposition or something like that. Um, you may need to come up with a strategy. Maybe you are coming up with a strategy. You may be coming up with a strategy to get out of a shitty situation. Um, but I, I mean, that Seven of Wands next to that Tower Reverse, I feel like there's been a lot of heartache. I feel like you've been in a painful situation where, you know, you may have been planning to leave or making plans to leave or coming up with a strategy or something like that. But now it's really time to do it. It's really time to do it. Now, there's a need to defend yourself, to protect yourself. You need to protect yourself this week. You know, I think the universe has your back, okay? Because this is like, this is like the universe, it really is. And this one is too. It's like the universe is telling you that you need to protect yourself. You need to, you need to push people away that have hurt you. I feel like you're in a tough position. You are in a very tough position where you always have to fight. You've had to fight, 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 fight. And I, I don't know, for some of you, it's a Libra. It, it is a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, or it's a Pisces. That's my guess. Um, I feel like you need to say no. You need to say no more. And you're going to have the... Well, there's protection here. You're, I feel like whoever you're dealing with can't win. You know, you're, you're going to be protected in some way. It's like the light that surrounds you that protects you is not going to let this person hurt you anymore. Now, I feel like whoever you're dealing with... I don't know if they're going to get... They could get in trouble. They could get in trouble. The law could come in. They could, they could end up... I don't know who you're dealing with, but you could be dealing with somebody that... Um, is a rule breaker. This person is a rule breaker. They, they, um, obnoxious. It feels like this person could be obnoxious. They explode. You know, there could, there could even be an actual explosion if it's not a person, um, that changes your circumstances. You will be protected. You are going to, I know that you are. You, it also feels like you're going to be put in a position of, Leadership, and I don't even have any cards that say that. It just feels like you are. It feels like you're going to be put in a a stronger position. 
be prepared to battle. I feel like there's going to be a battle. I think that there's going to be a fight and this fight could lead to a permanent loss. This permanent loss is actually a blessing in disguise. They're, they're, they're trying to heal you from a city. It's time. It's time to leave the past hurts behind. It's time to get on that path to recovery. It's time to heal. Okay. It is definitely time to heal. It feels like there's, it's almost like being put under attack. Okay. It is. It feels like there's you know, like being put under attack and you can't, there's no need to be attacked constantly. And I feel like you've been staying in a situation because I don't know, because it was comfortable, because it was easy, because you, you didn't have the money or something like that, or you didn't know your value, but I think it's time to fight back. I think that you need to fight back. And I don't like to tell people to fight back, but I feel like the universe is is saying that, you know, we have your back. You are protected. Defend yourself. Protect yourself. You got somebody here that is against you. You're going to need courage. You're going to you're going to need to probably act really really fast this week. It feels like if it, it feels like something um It's a surprise, put it that way. It is absolutely a surprise. Somebody could even show up, okay? Somebody could show up. They could show up at your door, and uh, all of a sudden, they could show up at your door. And I feel like whoever, if this is somebody showing up at your door, my advice is to not let them in, okay? Not let them in. Um, four of Wands reverse. Is that is the, like unhappy home something at home something it could be a change in the home you may be uh moving home this week changing your location and needing to not let anybody in you know don't you know it feels like somebody is arriving or trying to get in that you need to protect yourself from you need to protect yourself from somebody I feel like it's somebody that is very, very troubled. Okay? I do. You may have even been in a place of mental conflict. You know? You may have been stuck. You Maybe your hot hands were tied behind your back. But this is a week of change. It is definitely a week of change. There isn't, like I said, there's a higher power that is guiding you. I know that there is. I think you're going to be caught off guard. I do. I think you're going to be caught off guard by a sudden, it could be a sudden departure or a sudden arrival. This is all happening for a reason. It's happening because there's been too much pain. There's been too much suffering. And there's been refusing you. Somebody, I think it's you. You have been refusing to struggle through this. You've been refusing to let go of something that has caused you so much turbulence. There could be a massive fight, okay? There could be. This massive fight may may be the, the thing, may be the thing that... And this is light, and that is light. So light is going to come. The light is going to come to you, and it is going to guide you out of this situation, okay? You are going to be protected. Whoever you are dealing with, I don't know, maybe they end up in jail, they end up in handcuffs or something like that. Um, doesn't have to be. This person may be just, um, I don't know, something about the rubble, you know, left to clean up the mess, whatever the mess is. There's, there's going to be a mess. This is a mess. This is a very messy situation. I see you making a departure. You're probably going to be making a departure. There's a higher power here that is guiding you. They're guiding you towards something more loving. 
But in order for you to get there, you're going to have to face a major disruption first. And I hate to tell you that, but it's the truth. So this may be the week. you It's been avoided, but you can't avoid it anymore. So get prepared. I mean, this could be extreme health problems. It could be a, a fight, um, something you never saw coming. There could be something coming you never saw coming. It happens so fast. But this allows you to, I mean, it's like almost like liberation. It allows you to leave this past hurt behind. It le allows you to leave the pain behind. It, leads you, it allows you to start over and build a new foundation stronger next time. Your way. So anyway, I, there, could be, there could be a separation. Um, there could be with that four of wands reversed. It's like the party is over. This party is over. And maybe it, it starts with partying. And maybe the partying gets out of hand. Anyhow. That could be for some of you. Um, now this is not going anywhere. Somebody is not going anywhere. They are stuck. They are definitely stuck. Their mindset is stuck as well. And they're in a commitment or a home or a establishment that is dark, okay? It's dark, it's dreary, it's um, unstable, it's insecure. And I feel like the universe is saying they want you to be stable. They want you to be secure. They want you to leave this hurt behind. They want you to be in control. They want you to uh, protect yourself as well. You're going to need to defend yourself this week. You are. So anyhow, Sagittarius, you deserve to be loved. And spirit is guiding you definitely out of a situation that is unstable. This week may be uh, turbulent, to say the least. Good luck. <laughs>